In this episode of Campfire Cooking, we're making tin foil dinners. Now, doesn't that sound appetizing? Now, tin foil dinners are something that I've been making for about 36 years. I learned how to make tin foil dinner when I was a camp counselor at Camp McGovern, which is Big Brother Camp near Orangeville. Shout out to Camp McGovern. Now it's not there anymore, it's now in Hanover and it's a Big Brother Big Sister camp, but I digress. This is where I learned to make the tinfoil dinners. We'd go on out hikes with the campers and each camper would make their own dinner. They'd put their name on it, we'd pack them all together, then we'd head out on the hike. When we got to our spot, time for dinner, we'd pull out the tinfoil dinners, build up the fire, let the fire burn down, get some nice hot coals, throw the tinfoil dinners on. Easy peasy, no mess. It's really a good thing. Now what's in a tinfoil dinner is bone-in ham steak, potatoes, corn, and a slice of pineapple. And you put in a little bit of the pineapple juice to cook it all together, and it makes a fantastic meal. Now you can eat it right out of the tinfoil, or you can put it onto a plate. We're civilized, so we put it onto a plate. We'll show you how it's done. Step one, you build up a fire. Luckily, I brought my own fire starter here. Allie's the one. She's building up the fire, you want it nice and big, lots of wood in it, and then you want it to burn down. When it burns down, then you got a nice hot layer of coals, and that's what you want to cook on. Okay, folks, we're gonna be making tinfoil dinners. So we have four meals so for tinfoil. We're gonna put splotches of butter on the tinfoil to keep the potatoes from burning and give it flavor. Then we're gonna thinly slice potatoes and spread them evenly on the tinfoil. So I like to throw a lot of seasonings on my potatoes. So what I put on is sea salt, garlic salt, parsley, roasted garlic, basil, rosemary, and dehydrated onion. We will put the boneless ham slices on top. Then we will put corn. I use the canned corn. And then we will put a slice of pineapple or two on top of that. Once that is complete, you put your last piece of tinfoil over top and you fold all around the edges so it has a nice seal and they're ready to put in the fire pit. And we'll give them a quick little poke for the vent. So you wanna break down the fire, separate everything, spread it out. You don't wanna have any flames, you just wanna have a whole lot of hot coals. And when you put them in the fire, you're going to leave them potato side down. Do not, do not flip them over. Potatoes take longer to cook. Um, and then you're ready to go. You saw that very delicate process of putting the tinfoil dinners in the fire. That's it, just drop them in, good to go. That sizzling is the butter melting and boiling and uh, Steering right into the potatoes. Let them cool a little bit. Open them up. And you open up an end, let the heat escape there. When you open up the rest of it, you don't get the uh, scalding steam coming out. And that's kind of how it looks. Take this. And ever so delicately dump it. <laughs> Some of them get attached to there. You just scrape them off. And it might not look all that fantastic, but this is an incredible meal. We need smell o vision Yeah, it smells great. These potatoes, they've been cooked in butter. And tons and of And all seasoning. the spices. It's awesome. There we go. Okay. Ham, corn, pineapple, there it all is. You let that spread it out to cool. Steam and This is the finished product. It tastes great. 